A Democrat staffer, who recently announced on social media that he has joined the Biden Harris campaign as a deputy press secretary, works as a drag queen on weekends, according to his social media bio and social media posts reviewed by Fox News Digital. Subscribe my channel for update news. Eric Lipka, who most recently worked in Sen. Elizabeth Warren's D. Mass. Office before joining the Biden campaign, said he was thrilled to share that he has joined the Biden Harris campaign as deputy press secretary for Pennsylvania. In AX post on Wednesday, the post, which is now private, racked up hundreds of thousands of views over the last few days with several replies congratulating him, while others mocked him for joining the Biden campaign's sinking ship and pointed out his bio that reads, on weekends, drag queen. The popular libs of TikTok social media account amplified Lipka's drag queen gig with a follow-up post that has garnered 1.5 million views over the last few days. Lipka, who goes by the drag queen names, Erotica, Erica Lipka, and Erotica the Drag Queen, on social media, has several social media accounts on X, Facebook, and Instagram, but most of them were private as of Friday and then all of them were locked down shortly after Fox News Digital reached out to the Biden campaign for comment on Saturday afternoon. However, a Fox News Digital review found Lipka's name tagged in dozens of public Facebook posts dating back to 2021 when he was still a college student at Georgetown University. The public Facebook posts were often promotions for upcoming drag brunches, drag shows, and other events featuring drag queens, including Lipka. Earlier this year, he performed at Hampton Sydney College, a private Virginia liberal arts school for men, for their Unity Alliance Lavender Ball, an event that featured several drag queens. Another post from April 2024 lists Lipka as one of the drag queens participating in an Elevate Your Brunch drag event the following month. In January 2024, Lipka was listed as one of the drag queens participating in an event called Saint Saturday in Richmond, Virginia. Dozens of other posts over the last few years show him participating in drag shows in Rehoboth Beach, multiple Maryland venues, Connecticut, and various LGBTQ-friendly venues across Washington, D.C. In an April 2023 Facebook post, Lipka is listed on a promotion flyer for an event called Looney's Pub Presents Brunch Tunes, in College Park, Maryland. The Girls That Drag Together, Eggplant Emoji Bottoms Down Together, Drag Queen Nubia Love Jackson said in a 2022 Facebook post accompanied by a photo of Jackson and Lipka. Lipka replied, Baby you already know. The Biden campaign defended Lipka in response to a Fox News digital inquiry about him participating in drag shows, saying they were proud to have him on their team. We're proud to have a team of 200 talented Pennsylvania staffers, including Eric, highlighting Trump's record killing 275,000 jobs across the Commonwealth and his discriminatory and extreme Project 2025 agenda to make life worse for our families, said Jack Doyle, the Pennsylvania communications director for the Biden campaign. Lipka's Instagram, which is now private, also showed him tagged in multiple photos promoting events featuring drag queens in Washington, D.C. and Connecticut, many of which were also public on Facebook. One of Lipka's posts shows him and RuPaul's Drag Race, season 15 winner Sasha Colby last year at a D.C. venue with the caption, When Two Worlds Collide, staffing the boss to meet Sasha Colby. Lipka described the encounter in detail on his LinkedIn profile from when he served as a communications intern for Rep. Robert Garcia, D. Califf, and brought his perspective as a gay Latino to the office. He noted that one of the projects that he helped spearhead to build Garcia's brand and name ID was connecting his office with RuPaul's Drag Race, season 15 winner Sasha Colby for a meet and greet at a DC LGBTQ plus venue. We then pushed this to our LGBTQ plus lists, which went viral in that community, Lipka continued. Lipka's private X and Instagram accounts, which are under the erotica drag name, have thousands of followers combined. The X bio says, woman from the neck up, and the Instagram bio says, DC's twirling twunk, which is a term used among the LGBTQ community to describe males typically gay with the face of a twink, boyish looking, pretty, but the body of a hunk, muscular, jockey, according to Urban Dictionary. The Biden campaign hire comes amid the Biden White House facing backlash for a couple recent controversial hires. Tyler Cherry, 
who previously worked for the Department of the Interior, was promoted to the White House last month as a deputy press secretary. Cherry, however, faced backlash for several unearthed tweets, including comparing police to slave patrols and one 2014 anti-Israel post that went viral because it echoed a lot of the rhetoric currently heard on college campuses. He also came under fire for deleting thousands of his tweets after Fox News Digital reporting. Another recent controversial hire was Andy Velosky, who joined the White House digital team earlier this month to serve as the new deputy director of platforms. Fox News Digital revealed that he celebrated social media companies, finally, mercifully, banning President Trump on their platforms and asked, what took them so long? In a 2021 blog post days before President Biden took office, the Biden White House previously defended both hires, saying in two separate statements that they were proud to have them on their team. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for more information news. And also share my video with your friends. And uh, comment down in my video and suggest me uh, a news uh, for our next video. Thank you for watching my video.